Hey, how are you guys? Today we'll be learning how to make an image slider using jQuery. And for this, we'll need to follow these steps to get our work done. And first we'll begin with HTML, then we'll write CSS that is required for functioning. And finally, we'll write jQuery, and then we'll be testing our code. So let's begin with HTML. First we'll create a div with class slider. And inside the IV with class slider, we'll add some images and first image will have class active. That's it for this step. Next, we'll be writing CSS. And at first, we'll set height and width of slider and then position to relative. Next, we'll be styling images and we'll set max width and max height to 100% position to absolute as it will make it will make images to stack over one another opacity to zero as we are creating fade effect here and transition to one second and finally we'll set opacity of active class to 100% or one and that's it. Moving ahead. To a next step where we'll be writing jQuery. Make sure you add main jQuery file in the script tag before continuing. Link is in the description box below. Else your code won't work. In this step we'll first create a function named slider. Inside it, we'll get image with class active from our slider element. Then we'll equalate our current element or image with class active with zero using length property. As if it is true, which means element do not exist. And if it don't exist, we'll cl add class active to first image element of slider and if it does then we'll move to the else block inside else block at first we'll remove class active from the current element then we'll select next sibling using next function then we'll check if next sibling exists or not using length property something that we did above and if it don't then we'll add active class to first image of slider and if it do and we'll add class active to next element that's it now we'll close all blocks that we've opened and our function is ready now and finally we'll put a function slider inside set integral with time of 5 seconds which means image will change after every 5th second and that's it now finally it's time for testing a code as you can see right here it's working and if it is not working on your side then you can let us know in the comments below we'll solve your problems and you can also contact us on our facebook page And here's one thing that you can hire us for your projects, especially friend ed projects, by contacting us on our Facebook page. And make sure you subscribe us as we make new tutorials every week. And don't forget to watch our other videos which are on the screen right now. And finally, follow us on Twitter and Facebook as you can get our all latest updates from there. Thanks for watching, I'm Sid and it's Mindspeaks.